In today's episode of Oversharing on the Internet, <laughs> why did I pick this job? Animangafan342 asks, I dropped some clogging logs. Can the Toto handle this? I was considering Toto because I hear good things and they make toilets that comply with my region's GPF standards. I don't mind if it sounds like a jet engine or paying a little more. Noisy flush is better than having to plunge the toilet. Is Toto still superior in this regard? <laughs> this is the part of the video where I say, that's a great question. I'm glad you asked. <laughs> but I can't do that with a straight face. Guys, gals, and non-binary pals, welcome to Potty Talk. I'm Dave with Remodel Media, and since 2005, I've been helping people put together kitchens, baths, outdoor kitchens, and various other home renovation projects. I'm on a mission to eliminate remodel regret, and I do that by bringing you the latest tips, tricks, and products for your home remodel. So, if you're new here, follow along. We'll have some fun. The short story is, yes, your Toto, I can't believe I'm about to record myself saying this, your Toto can handle your clogging logs just fine. Well, technically, I don't know about how big your logs are, but I've literally never seen any human clog a Toto unless there was a problem with the actual plumbing underneath the floor. But that's not the toilet's fault. A lot of people think it has to do with water usage or GPF, gallons per flush, but the reality is it has to do with the way the toilet works. Things like a larger trap, fully glazed all the way through, a larger flush valve, rim jets, a siphon jet, are all indicators of a better performing toilet. And when you're looking at something like the Toto Drake 2, this particular toilet is probably your hallmark as far as what Toto's performance is going to be. It has all those features that I listed. It's just not the cheapest option. It's going to be in the four to $500 category. If you're looking for something closer to about the $200 category from Toto, may I suggest the Toto Entrada? I've used this on a number of property management projects where someone wanted a decent flushing Toto with most of those features, but they didn't want to pay, uh, they weren't paying four or 500, they wanted to pay 200 to 250. You know, they wanted to cut that price in half. The Toto Entrada is something that you can do there as well. I've had family members that have owned it and they, they insist it works wonderfully. Thanks for watching. I hope you got some good information out of that episode. Go ahead and click here for more videos. Go ahead and click here to subscribe. And make sure you check out the description below for relevant links to some of the products that we discussed today. And leave your comments and questions down below because I love answering them. As always, I'll see you in the next one.